Yo, what is good, fellas? Hope we're all having an awesome Saturday morning. Ultimate Legends are live. We got Jerry Rice, Mark Bravo, and Gerard Mayo live in game right now. We're going to take a look at all of them, and then we're going to go over and look at the store. There's a pretty interesting store offer. Really good chances to pull this Jerry Rice, but it is a little more expensive. But without further ado, let's look at Jerry Rice's stats, abilities, and is he worth what he's going to cost? Because, fellas, this Jerry Rice is going to cost you your arm, hands down. All right, so Jerry Rice gets built-in jukebox for free. In my opinion, this is the best ability on wide receivers for after the catch. My Tyreek Hill has it, and uh, it's gross. It's really, it's a good time. Ability-wise, though, besides zero AP jukebox, isn't as good as I was hoping free, but he does get some good discounted abilities. Zero AP route tech, cool. One AP red zone threat, one AP third down threat, and zero AP receiver apprentice. Okay, depends how you run your offense. If you don't run a hot route master quarterback, cool. Jerry Rice, zero AP, route tech, and receive, ride receiver apprentice, money. But if you do run a hot route master quarterback, like I'm assuming most of us do, then route tech and probably third down threat for one AP or just straight up route tech and jukebox four zero. Card looks fire though. Stat wise, ability wise looks great. Stat wise, can't get much better than this. Six foot two, 98 speed, 92 jump, 99 short, 99 medium, 98 deep. Yeah, this guy is a route running genie. With route tech, card's going to be shredding man coverage. Jerry Rice does look very good. I want to see what he's going for though. I haven't peeped yet. It's been out for about 15 minutes and yeah, he is going for under a million coins and boys, I can tell you why that is. There's a store offer we'll check after we check out the other two players and he's giving, and it's giving out just bangers. It's a 52% chance or something to pull a 99 overall. Really, really good worth your bang of your buck if you save it low key for next week. But we'll talk about that when we get there. Let's go check out the two set piece legends though. All right, so I was just thinking about that Jerry Rice card as we go over to Gerard Mayo. If you're going to pick him up, go do it right now as soon as you guys get off this video because Jerry Rice is not a card that should be going under a million, so go grab him. Gerard Mayo, though, looks really good ability-wise, okay stat-wise, 95 speed, 6 foot 1, uh, basically a worse Bobby Wagner stat-wise, to be completely honest with you. Same height, a little bit slower. Okay, ability-wise, he is significantly better. Nothing special in the X Factor, X -factor section. We kind of expect that by now. But zero AP lurk artist built in, cool. This is where it gets cool. Zero AP mid zone, zero AP secure, and zero AP flat zone, and then one AP enforcer supreme. So two things: you don't want to use her on him. Throw mid zone, lurk artist, and flat zone, and he's got three baked in abilities for just a linebacker flying around the field. Cool. If you do want to use her, secure tackler and enforcer supreme with the baked in lurk artist for one AP. Gerard Mayo has a insane stack, but on like a top 10 user right now, his abilities is making this card cracked. Let's go check out Mark Bravo though, a dude I have never heard of in my life. Yeah, so do you guys even know who this dude is? Giants fans, maybe. Let's see what he's going for before. I forgot to do that. We'll check Gerard Mayo after. 650,000 coins, 150,000 more coins than Jerry Rice. Let's, come on, let's chill out with that special offer. Six foot four, 254 pounds, 96 speed, 99 short, 94 medium, 90 run block. This card is, this card is basically a better real deals Gronk. 90 run block is disgusting. It's, it's another left tackle out there, right tackle, wherever you run the ball. Zero AP tank is really funny. That kind of geeks. Okay, this card looks really good. Zero AP leapfrog, free red zone threat, one AP route tech, free jukebox. Wow. Okay, Mark Bravo looks really good. Where is the catch on this card? Because ability-wise, he is gross. I don't see anything that makes me like not like this card. Yeah, this card is really good. He is six foot four, which isn't six eight, six six, but six four is not small. Mark Bravo, really freakishly good card. I, I don't see anything wrong with this guy. I mean, yeah, he's not going to have elite deep route running or elite medium route running, but dude, he's 90 run block with zero AP tank, zero AP juke and leapfrog or, or red zone threat. This guy is, this card is elite. We're going to swing back over and just make sure Gerard Mayo isn't going for something outrageous. Now I want to check Jerry Rice's price again. I'm recording this at 1053 Saturday morning. Yeah. So 700 K for Gerard Mayo. That's, that's way too much. He'll be down to like 400K-ish by the end of the week. Jerry Rice. 
If I can see this guy for like 750,000 coins, I'll pick him up right now. Yeah, I mean, this card, I mean, it's because of this special offer we're going to go look at. Look how many Jerry Rices are up with the, uh, it's been live for 24 minutes. All right, I've been glazing this special offer for the past however long this video is. Here it is. Contains two 96 overall Ultimate Legend players, and either 196 or 199 overall Ultimate Legend Champion, whatever, the LTD. It's called the UL LTD Opportunity Pack. Here are the odds. 52% chance you're pulling an LTD. I don't think the odds get much better than that for 30 bucks. Is it worth it? If you have 30 bucks to blow on a game, sure. I won't be opening it because, you know, Madden doesn't pay my bills yet. Hit the subscribe button. But this pack is really good value. Hopefully, though, you don't pull three. If you pull three straight 96s, you just got bent over by EA. But let's say you pull a 98, a 96, and a 99 Jerry Rice. You're walking out there with 1.5, 1.8 million coins out of 30 bucks. That's better than... That might be, that could be that has the most opportunity to give you the best bang for your buck. The rest of the store looks fairly similar. Obviously, you know, your typical $100 bundle that nobody should ever open. We'll rip one of these packs, probably get bent by it. But let's see if we can pull a Jerry Rice. Come on, come on, come on. No, obviously not. 90 overall Fred Taylor. Awesome. Oh, big one. Okay. Big money, big money, big money. 97 Jimmy Smith. And then, yeah, so we'll obviously take Jimmy Smith there. Cool. That's actually my best Ultimate Legend pack of the year. Kind of crazy. What's he going for nowadays, Jimmy? Probably training. 140,000 coins. Not awful. Thanks, Jimmy. Appreciate it. What's crazy about that, though, I'm selling this Jimmy Smith for 130,000 coins. Like, that's a good... It's supposed to be a good pull. I only made 40k off that pack. Like, those packs are disgustingly expensive. I don't think we see anything else new today besides that special offer. Jerry Rice, Gerard Mayo, and Mark Bravo. If you're going to pick up Jerry Rice, I would do so before that pack expires, preferably right now. Um, remember, do your solo challenges. We should be able to claim a free Ultimate Legend in a few weeks. Not soon, but coming up. Make sure you guys are honestly just catch up on all your solo challenges. To be honest, we should be getting a free weekly wild card very, very soon. I'll have a video on Wednesday, though, going over the best one to pick. So, you know, if you're into Madden or you like me, consider hitting that subscribe button. We hit 600 yesterday. I just wanted to say thank you, guys. It means, like, do this super chill. Like, we grow we're growing. It's, it's awesome. Please consider subscribing if you enjoy me on the road to 1K. That's enough random shit talk for me. I'll catch you boys later today with the Jaden Daniels gameplay. And until then, have a great Saturday morning. Peace.